Hello and welcome back to another episode here with Minecraft Nether Survival. Where in this episode, we're starting a little bit from where we left off in the last episode. If you did not watch the last episode, we raided one of the new Bastion Remnants. Hopefully I said that right. I'm not going to check this time because I am confident that I got it. I'm going to get it one of these days. Anyways, I'm going back to base Delta and... I found something. As you can see, I still have all the loot from uh, from the last episode. The the Bastion Remnant is right behind me, actually. Directly behind me. And I found something here that uh, we did not get to take a look at in the last episode. So how about we do that, shall we? It is right up ahead here. Um, and that is the Ruined Portals. We did not actually get to see one. Um, in the last episode, nor did we get to loot one, so I think that we should go ahead and do that. But first, I would like to just take a look at my inventory, get rid of some stuff, and, well, I, there's no piglins around, so I think I can allow myself to take just a little bit of gold. Also, I would like to get some netherrack for the purpose of doing some bridges, because, yeah, I need my netherrack for bridges. So let me get this. A thing to note, though, uh, in the snapshot that came out after the basalt, no, sorry, the bastion remnants was added, um, the loot in the chest there have been decreased, so to say. Basically, you will no longer be able to find uh, what is this called again? Netherite tools and armor, but instead they have replaced it with diamond tools and armor. I, 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 I believe. Yeah, I believe, um, I believe armor as well. I'm pretty sure. Either way, they've done that. And to be honest, I'm okay with it. Because netherite is supposed to be rare. Right? Netherite is supposed to be rare. And if you can just find a whole bunch of bastion remnants and not go around to dig for the ancient debris, then, well, it kind of defeats the purpose, I suppose. So I understand that. And I'm okay with that, <laughs> actually. Um, I'm not sure. They, I think they tweet some other loot as well. I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, that is something to keep in mind. Uh, let's go ahead and check this portal right here. Ow. Alright. There's also this right here. But, um... Oh, dear. <laughs> Gotta be careful of that. Alright, let me get my netherrack here and let's bridge out and hope that we won't have any casualties. I do not have any fire uh, fire protection on me in case we fall or anything, so gotta be a little bit careful here. Alright, but here it is. I absolutely love these. Also, I think these now spawn uh, more rare. Also, there is a gold block. A gold block. Ow. A gold block. I want that. Add that to the collection. Um... What else is here? You know what? I think we can afford to just open this chest. Ooh. Well, what do we have? Obsidian. We got iron nuggets. Okay. Then we got gold nuggets and glistering melon. I just wish there were a way to make potions down here. I know we can't get water down here, but I want a way to make potions. That would be so cool. And a golden helmet with projectile protection 3. I mean, I'll do a swap. I'll do a swap. Why not? And I'll bring the glistering melon, actually. Can we make that into melon seeds? No, we cannot. I'll bring those, though, because there's no way for us to actually get melon. But anyway, this is not too bad of a place. I like this. I like this. The ruins of a ruined portal. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Anyways, I just wanted to showcase that. And let's not fall into the hole of doom. Yeah, I just wanted to show that, but in this episode, also, I want to... I don't feel like I'm done with the Bastion Remnants, basically. And I know that there are more rooms that you can find, so in today's episode, I actually want to find another one. So I'm going to head back to base Delta, I'll check in with you there, and, uh, well, then, I'll pick up some more food if I have any, maybe get some on the way here in the Crimson Forest, and yeah, I'll meet you back at base Delta, and then I'm gonna go ahead and try to find another Bastion Remnant. Because, to be honest with you, I won't mind getting some more loot and checking out some of the, more, some of the rooms that are there. So yeah, I think I'm gonna do that, gonna grab some gold here. 
And yeah, I'll meet you back at base Delta. I, I can't carry much more gold with me without having to constantly convert it. So definitely not going to pick up every single piece of gold that I find. Plus, we have like 33 blocks of it. But still, we want gold. But anyways, I'll check back in with you at base Delta. Alright, I made it back safely to base Delta with a bunch of loot. And uh, yeah. I really like this space. I really, really do like this space. Alright, well then. Um, did I show... I don't think I showed in the last episode that I made the smokers. Did I? I don't think I did. Anyways, I made smokers to be able to cook food faster. I think that was the suggestion in the comments. Um, and also to use the barrels instead of the chests so you could open them uh, without having the issue with the full blocks, which is a really good idea. Only problem right now is I don't have any spare food here. So that's an issue, but hey, there's a crimson forest right outside. I should be able to hunt some stuff down. But let me start off by putting valuable stuff away, uh, organize my inventory, and I'll be right back. All right, so here we have the treasure. Well, let me put it maybe like this. There we go. Cool. So we got aged debris and we got iron. Actually, let me convert all of these iron nuggets that we got into ingots. That's a lot of iron right there. And let us convert these golden nuggets as well so we can see a little bit better what we have left. And these, Gilbert Blackstone, I'm pretty sure. Uh, do I have any like coal, charcoal, anything, blaze rods? I do not. Hmm. Let me get also, how much, how much crying obsidian do I have? Eight. How much is, I think you need six for like a respawn anchor. I think it would be nice to have a respawn anchor here. Um, <laughs> since if I die, I kind of spawn all the way back at home base. Whoa, hey buddy, what are you doing here? Huh. Oh dear, that's two of them. Oh dear, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. What is this? Okay, I mean, it would have been per that's another one. It would have been perfect if one of them could just drop me two coal or something. Hey, buddy. Oh, you're trying to get the height advantage, huh? Oh, dear. Huh? 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 Ooh, a coal. Nice. <laughs> that is exactly what I needed. Well, I want blaze rod, but I mean, hey. I also want some glowstone so I can duplicate these arrows. Okay, I see skeletons and blazes. Let's get some action, shall we? Let's get some of this action. I don't have a shield. I should make a new shield. I should make a new shield. That's three with the skeletons. No, wait, four? Oh, dear me. Oh, dear me. Okay. Smack. 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 Smacky. Smack. 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 Smacky smack. Okay. No, ow. Okay. Why did I say ow? I didn't even get hurt. I just need another piece of fuel, please. Ow! Oh, cool. That's all I need. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, I need I need more food badly. I need more food badly. <laughs> Let's get this gold smelting. They were right around the staircase there. That's not creepy at all. Okay. Either way. Let's, uh, wait, what? Oh, you cannot smelt it. Wait, what are you then supposed to do with it? What are you then supposed to do with it? Well then, apparently you cannot smelt this. And it also says on the Minecraft wiki that it's not an ore? I guess. Okay. That was terrifying. Okay, won't do that again. Uh <laughs> So it's not an ore, apparently. Okay, that scared me bad. Apparently, it's not an ore as such. So you can't smell it. I really wish... Wasn't that a thing? I'm not sure. Hmm. But I hope that is going to become a thing. I'm going to keep them just in case. Also, they look cool. Um, so yeah, anyways, I'm going to go ahead, get them a new shield. Hopefully not lose this one this time. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go and get some food for this expedition or this mission 
Uh, oh yeah, you can't do. Oh dear, this this is getting complicated. <laughs> gotta chop down the tree and gotta get the planks from the tree and then gotta get the planks into sticks so you can use the sticks to smoke the thing in the thing. Not complicated at all, but the smoker is really really nice to have and you can use it. Uh, you can make it using um, what's it called? What's it called again? Using the netherwood stuff. So that's cool. Anyways, I'm gonna try. Oh hey buddy. I'm gonna try out without hurting my armor too much to get a bunch of food and I'll be back. Would also really love some glowstone if I can come by any. That would be pretty good so I can make a respawn anchor. I want a respawn anchor here. Uh, so if I can like reach some glowstone somewhere that would be epic. This may be a bit difficult since I have a sword and it does area of effect and there's two of these things here. Oh, okay. Just let the piglins do the work for me, I suppose. I guess I could help them out. Oh, that, he took one of them. I'm gonna take this other one. <laughs> They're gonna take that guy. I'm gonna take this one. Ow, whoa, you really get to fly. All right, I'm gonna help you now. I'm gonna help you. These guys really sometimes really help me. Ow. Oh no. Okay. Yep. Take some of it. Take half. I take half. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. That is cool that that happens sometimes. Alright. Back home finally. I'm hurt and also hungry. And yep. That also, yeah. Yeah. Down to my axe. <laughs> Uh, Alright, two coal, one in there, half of that, and half of that, and let's really quickly make a respawn anchor. Uh, I believe I need that, let me also really quickly duplicate these arrows, like so, I do believe it is like this. Respawn anchor, where should we put this? Um, where should we put this, right here? 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 Hmm. Here. Can always move it, I think. <laughs> and let us recharge it all the way to full energy. There we go. Also, it gives quite a bit of light, doesn't it? Wow. Alright, not bad, not bad. Alright, let's put that in there. That was really quickly to cook. Okay, cool. Got food. I'm yeah, I'm probably gonna get some mushrooms as well. But uh, we'll see. All right, I think I'm ready to go. And uh, just because this episode is already quite long, I'm just going to return when I find a bastion remnant. You don't need to see me travel all the way over there. And uh, yeah, I'll see you when I find one. So I'm probably gonna go out the back door or should I go the fortress way? Hmm, kinda wanna go in a different direction. Probably gonna go in that direction. We'll see. Anyways, I'll be right back. Oh dear, oh dear, how will we do that? Okay, I'll be right back when I find one, so stay tuned. I must say, traveling in these soul sand valleys are really quickly. As long as the boots don't break, of, break, of course, then uh, yeah, it's not it's not too bad at all. Uh, skeleton. Well, won't hurt to get some extra arrows, now can it? Should be pretty easy. Alright, it's good to have a shield. It's good to have a shield. And also, you can just keep running. Essentially. You can just... Uh, why are there with the skeletons in the middle? That's because there's a fortress here that... I don't think I knew about. And I'm being attacked from everywhere and everyone. Okay, that's not good. Status update. Still being shot at. Still in Soul Sand Valley ter territory. And literally being shot at. Literally being shot at. I mean, I, I don't really mind the skeletons. What I do mind is the gas, mainly because they're extremely loud as well and very destructive. Okay. Oh no, dead end. Uh, wait. Cave. <laughs> Yay. Ah, the, ah. These boots make short work of this. Ah. There better be something in this direction, otherwise. Huh. Ah. Anything here? Nope. Gotta, gotta get back out in there. Oh dear. At least here I can mine gold relatively safely without a herd of piglins attacking me. So that's at least nice. 
The Soul Sand Valley is huge. Huge. Ah! <laughs> it's so satisfying to do that. Uh, but yeah, it's huge. <laughs> but hey, it makes for quick travel time. So that's pretty cool. No. Just don't get stuck like here where you're... Oh dear. Hey, Enderman. I do not see any issues with you. Okay. That is tough. It can also be very dangerous having soul speed near ledges like this. Extremely dangerous. So keep that in mind if you're traveling in the soul sand valleys with soul boost 3. Uh, good thing to keep in mind. This place is dangerous. Oh, my axe broke. My axe broke. My axe broke. That's a skeleton. Oh, dear. Ah! Oh, dear. This is... This is a bad situation for me to be in. Why do I have so much health? Okay, hold on. Freeze. Whew. Okay, so that was eventful. Uh, the clip where you saw with the gravity table was... You didn't see... I've had enough of you. You did not see what uh, what happened over there, but it ended up with me crafting up my new stone sword and stone axe, and then, like, seven things ended up shooting me, and then I had to run away from them because close to dying, and then I ran into even more things shooting at me, and, uh, yeah, I'm happy to now be out of the Soul Sand Valley. And, uh, guess what? I, uh, I want some glowstone, because I've got arrows, right? Might as well uh, duplicate them. But see, uh, look, look here. Look, just look, look. Oh dear. Look just um, a little bit more to the right. You, you see it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I see it too. <laughs> Found one. Finally. Okay.